It's on a character from the owner on DeviantArt. I'm not gonna say her name until I get the character. The character's name is Arisa Namikaze. Like I said in my last review, disclaimer. I'm not here to disown or discard the character or the owner in any way, shape or form. I'm only here to say my two bits on the character. That's all. Let's go with the design of the character first, shall we? Yeah, Arisa, or Arisa might get down in her looks as a Marisu, but I don't see any Marisu traits on her. I mean, yeah, brownish hair with black stripes and turquoise eye color maybe? Greenish, blue, whatever. She might come off as a Marisu, but her hair drastically goes darker by the time we enter Shippuden. And around the end of Shippuden or during the fourth great ninja war in the design character division or whatever she actually gets the red hair most Uzumaki has but she still has her bluish green turquoise eyes which I kinda like because as far as I know, most Uzumakis has different eye color. Take even take a look at Naruto's mom. She has sort of dark blue, navy blue colored eyes. Mix it together with her red hair and there you go, you got it. Gugina. But Arisa's colors looks fairly normal. And even her outfits looks yeah, I know the colors are a little mishmash, but I kind of like them. They seem decent enough. Heck, she even wields a fucking sword, and I'm sorry if I just sweared. And here's a little disclaimer for my swearing parts. Disclaimer, I might be swearing a few, po few times during my reviews. And that's probably all I have to say for her design department. And now her story. I won't go too much into the depth of her story. I want you guys to read it for yourself. <laughs> Instead of hearing me babble about it. All I have to say is that her story is well made. She redo it uh, a while ago. All I can say is... Well, I don't care if you guys don't like her pairing. She ships her character Arisa because her timeline is set the same timeline as Itachi. Uz not, how the fuck am I gonna say Uzumaki? He's a Nujia! Fuck me! And because they have a son named Iso, Aizo, Namikaze. I really like how. Well, how her whole timeline works. Her personality is really good, appearance, as I said in the design, fairly good and pretty good. 
doing all the timelines, timescape part two, part one, abilities, everything. It looks pretty good. The relationships looks good as well. And I'm sorry, I'm just skim looking through all of them. And the quotes, they're good. Cause she even says, what the hell are you doing? In one of them. <laughs> I can't like it. That's probably it. As a final score, looking through all of this, I would give a recent Namikaze 8.5 out of 10. It's a fairly good ma made character. Story, everything flows sort of well with what the creator had intended. And that's about it. Hope to see you guys next time on my next review. In the name of anime, I will thunderbolt you out to oblivion. Bye bye!